is Sunday, June 22nd. We are driving home from Corsair Joe's house. I actually spent the last two nights there. And I have not showered, so it'd be very nice to get home and do that. Um, so it's very nice and sunny out today. And I've actually been to literally just parties the past couple days. So I might sound like I'm hungover, but I didn't drink one sip of alcohol because I don't like doing that. I really, really hate it when people think that you have to get drunk or high in order to have a good time party. And I think that's ridiculous. It seems like the kind of lazy thing to do to enjoy the party. What you could be doing is doing absolutely nothing like we do sometimes, or actually play games. What kind of games do we play? Uh, video games. Yeah, video games, you know, like those kind of games. So, yeah. Uh, yeah, we're in that. Today is a, just going to be a normal day, I guess. We'll take it home and take a shower. I might go on a walk, maybe continue this vlog then. Uh, yeah, this is, this is Gold Bar. This is a town that I used to live in a long time ago. The first 16 years of my life took place here. You know, besides school and all that. Although I didn't live in this area, Gold Bar. I lived in, like, a little further. Yeah, good times, good times. First, when I lived here, I was really close to the train tracks, as you can see over there. And they were much more, you can even much more easily hear the trains here. <sighs> so, it's important for you guys to know that most of July, I am not going to be able to record Let's Play episodes, so I will not be home most of July. I'm going to be doing a lot of traveling, most likely, and so i got to figure something out for my Let's Play channel if I want something to, to you know, be released every day while I'm gone, and I might need some help from viewers for that. crazy month. In like August I'll be working at the fair, but that's not, not until like late August, so it's no big deal. Alright. We're now one, one, one mile away from our next destination. And I'm really tired today. Because, you know, this time it's kind of a late night. So was the previous night. So, but yeah, I just left my party. So, anyways, let's uh, put it here, I guess, because uh, I'll just be going my walks and I'll continue it then. So, see you guys then. It is 2:51 p.m. currently, and I am at the uh, parking lot for Bank of America and Jack in the Box over there. So, uh, yep, it's uh, another sunny day here. Oh, uh, by the way, sorry about not finishing yesterday's vlog. Today, yesterday was kind of unfinished because I did promise I would say, like, the time of day that the sun would set. It was uh, 9, 10 p.m., so that was supposedly the longest day of the year. It was summer solstice, so, you know, it was uh, sunrise at 5.09 a.m. and then uh, sundown at 9, 10 p.m., so pretty much it. Um, did I ever mention I got a haircut? I don't know, it's kind of late because that was actually like a, about a month ago, I think, now at this point, so. Really no point bringing it up now, so. I need to, what? I need to take a look at campus housing because I actually got this in the mail a few days ago, so. Yeah, this will be really interesting, actually. I think this is probably one of the most exciting parts about college is, you know, looking at places to the 
location on campus I'll be living at, so I'm really excited for that. Um, also, I got this, uh, did I ever mention also I got this keychain? Yeah, that was part of my senior year stuff and graduation and whatnot. But yeah, I actually got a Milo Jackson box. I got a Coke and uh, chicken strips and curly fries. But uh, anyways, uh, I guess I'm going to go for a walk again today. So, um, you know, as soon as I'm on that, I guess I'll continue the vlog there. You know, finish it off, I guess. But probably a long talk about stuff like usual, you know, because... That's pretty much what I've been doing lately, so might as well keep it up. I think it's really nice that, you know, I'm finally getting back to doing vlogs, but the f thing is, is that it seems like I'm only able to, you know, focus on one channel at a time. Like, I've noticed in the past that typically I have, like, I don't know, like, there's got to be a way that I can focus on two channels at once, you know, focus on making my Let's Plays and my, you know, vlogs at the same time, because I would love to one day be... A successful daily vlogger and a YouTube Let's Player. So, you know, in order to go towards that, I need to be able to focus on multiple things at once. But, uh, yeah. So, anyways, uh, I got my Seattle Mariner shirt on. I don't know why I have the shirt and how long I've had it. You know, for some reason, I was, I was kind of a loose fan of the, of the Mar uh, Mariners, you could say. I used to be. Like, I'd wear their merchandise, and yet I would watch almost none of their games next to none of their games, I guess. And, you know, it's just, I don't know, just kind of a funny thing, I suppose. Yeah, this is one of the plazas we have here at uh, Monroe. It's funny, there's actually a hall at Eastern Washington University called Monroe Hall. And I guess it's where all the math classes are or something like that. So that'll be interesting, you know, attending math classes there. But yeah, it's just crazy. I don't know if it'll be, be much different than you know, living in Sultan, you know, up at up the, up at the top of that hill like I did, like I do now, because technically I was sort of living, I was living right next to my high school campus, so, I don't know, maybe this will feel about the same, the only difference is I won't be walking up and down a large hill every day, but then again, Cheney itself is kind of a hill, but, eh, whatever, it's, it's more like a gradual hill than anything, so, uh, again, like I said a few minutes ago, I'm going to meet you guys, I guess, back at the river, I suppose, for the remainder of this vlog. So, see you guys then. So on Friday, I came out here and discussed with you guys that I got accepted into EWU and um, how things are going to change from this point on. Well, actually not this point on, but, you know, once, you know, this fall starts. Well, um, now we're going to get into some specific dates on which uh, I will be not at home because it's very important that I mention this because, again, uh, these will affect my Let's Plays, those of you who watch them. And also, um, you guys will see a lot of different stuff, like the scene, scenery will change for quite a bit on this vlog. So I think it's important that I mention on here. Um, so specific dates that you guys should be aware of are June 28th through July uh, 25th. And um, be after July 25th, there will be, as far as I have planned so far, nothing until August 20, August 20th or the 21st. One of those two. I believe it's the 20th. Because um, I believe that's when the fair starts. Anyways, um, June 28th, this, which is next Saturday actually, um, me and my dad are going to fly out to Tulsa, Oklahoma. And we will be spending the next, uh, was it 10, 13 days, the next 13 days there, because um, we're going to be there until July 10th. And sometime during that time, those 13 days that we are there, we're going to take two days to drive over to Silver Dollar City in Missouri, which is a western themed amusement park, so... And I have never been there. My dad went there once when he was, he said, six or four. So it's been a long time. And now I get to go there myself and see, you know, why I don't really hear much about it. You know, because not a lot of people seem to talk about it. So I think it'll be interesting to go check it out. 
I think it'll be a really nice place, but you know, that's that's before even going there, so I won't jump into conclusions. Um but yeah, we're gonna go there and we're also going to kinda of spend the night in Missouri, somewhere in Missouri near Silver Dollar City, I guess, with uh, a friend of my dad's and her niece, so that'll be interesting. Um, also worth noting is that um, I haven't been to Oklahoma since 2008, December 2008. Um, so we're going to be celebrating the 4th of July there as well. So, yeah, that's going to be very exciting. Very, very exciting. Um, so that's basically what I'm going with. Oh, um, here's another thing I need to mention about this vlog that's going to change you know, while I'm there. Is that there's, uh, there's a specific, uh, like... I don't know if I'll be doing actual vlogs while I'm there, but I will be recording every day is what the plan is. And if I record one day, but it's not technically a vlog because I'm not discussing like life and stuff or what I did that day, then they're probably not going to be called vlogs. They're going to be just the dates and then uh, what's going on in the video. You know, because I do have videos like that in the past, so... This is not something new to my channel, and but I might still count them like towards somewhat as a vlog like I might put them in my play vlog playlist from now on you know just because you know it's not necessarily me talking I don't really have to be talking all the time to be showing up my life I can just be like recording stuff that's going on without you know talking and I think that's that could be you know considered part of a vlog as well in my personal opinion but yes they're not gonna have vlogs after the dates you know just saying in the titles so that's something that's gonna happen a lot this summer you know so so yeah, there's that. There's our Oklahoma trip. Um, and uh, I don't know if I'll be going there ever again after... Well, I shouldn't say ever again. I really shouldn't, but... My dad figured that this was the last chance we could do it because it's the last summer that I'm really free and I'm not expected to do anything, you know, so... You know, the summer between me going to college and graduating high school, so... That's the reason why we're going. And we were going to go last year, but we didn't have the money, but now this year we do. So, that's basically the whole reason behind it. And then, we come back on July 10th, and the next day, literally the next day after we get back, uh, the Sultan Summer Shindig begins. And just like the past two years, I'll be attending it every, all three days. So, it's July 11th or 13th is the Sultan Shindig. So, even though I'll be home those days, technically I won't be because I will be at this, ev at this event pretty much all day those three days. So technically, I'm not, I won't be home those days either to, to record LP videos. And um, the second day, July 12th, Saturday, um, is, the Sul is the Sultan Shindig Parade. I have watched it the past couple years, but I did not attend it. But, I mean, uh, by attend, I mean it wasn't in it, because it's going to change this year. I will be in the Shindig this year, the Shindig Parade. So that's going to be very exciting, because I was in Spring Marching Band this year, and they do perform there, so... You know, they actually want seniors to come back to perform in that, so... Yeah, I'll be part of that. I guess it's probably the last high school event I'll be in, supposedly, so... I think it's very important, anyways. Um, but yeah, the Shindig is sort of an annual event that happens at my... at Sultan. And... You know, it's just something that I love to attend. Those... Well... It's not just because they have rides there, you know, because it's sort of a carnival, but there's also other stuff, like there's a car show on Saturday. Like, it, pretty much all the exciting stuff happens on Saturday. They show off old cars and stuff like that in the parade, and, you know, just a lot of cool stuff like that. So that's that. And then, uh, Monday, July 14th, there's a possibility, this is not official yet, but there's still a big chance that I will be going to Disneyland with Corsair Joe. Um, Corsair Joe is my best friend, and he told me about this trip earlier, and, you know, he said that's possible that I could, po I could probably come if I provide money, which I am planning to. I'm not going to say how much, because, you know, it's just stuff, you don't really want to talk about how much, uh, uh, I don't know, I just feel like I shouldn't talk about that, but I will just say it's really expensive, and it's surprising you know, how much money I'm able to provide, but yeah, it's just, that's just that out of the way. But yeah, he said that the trip will be a week long, so supposedly from July 14th, 
you know, we're, we're not flying down to California. We're actually driving the whole way, so that's probably going to take two days. So there's that two days. We're driving down to California, you know, sightseeing and whatnot along the way, I suppose. And then for three days, I guess, is where we're actually at Disneyland and, you know, attending and, I guess, staying at resorts and like that. I don't know. I've never been to Disneyland, so that's why I really want to go on this trip. And I am really... And that's why I'm, you know, trying to provide money, you know, at, as my best effort to get going to going with him. So, you know, I'm really looking forward to that if it, if it you know, if it works out. Um, and then after that, July 21st, when we're back from the, you know, from the Disneyland trip, um, I am sort of home. July 21st through... Uh, July 23rd sort of and then July 24th this is also gonna be a lot of fun we're gonna be going on a road trip the four of us Corsair Joe you know the 49 we play members uh, and we're going to be going on a road trip to Cheney where Uni Eastern Washington University is located and we're gonna spend the night there and then the next day is freshman orientation at Iwu so you know, it's and it's for me, but I want my friends to come along because, first of all, making that five-hour trip um, alone is just ridiculous and definitely not going to happen. So I want to bring friends with me, at least, you know, someone. So that's why they're coming with me. And they also have a chance to, you know, go through it with me. So it's just going to be a lot of fun because we'll be staying in a motel, we'll be playing video games, we'll be going out to eat and stuff like that. It's, gonna, it's just going to be really exciting. So, you know, you know, after the orientation's over at, like, 5 p.m. on... July 25th, and then we come back here. And that's when my insane month ends. And then, 20th, August 20th through September 1st, I am working at the Evergreen State Fair once again. So, that's basically my, sum my crazy summer explained, as, as it is so far as of today, you know, June 22nd. You know, plans might change, like there might be more plans, or I might not end up going to Disneyland, whatever. Just plans might change along the way, but that's where it, where it stands now. So if you guys don't see a lot or if any videos on my channel during those times, that's why. It's just, you know, it's just crazy what's going on. So, you know, I figure I'd let you guys know about all that. At any rate, this has been a very long vlog. It's been about 18 minutes now, so we seriously need to end it right now. So, um, I am, my name, yes, I am Aaron, and you got... And I will see you guys, uh, guys, I guess, tomorrow. Goodbye.